Hell yeah, nigga. I got nine kids, nigga. <laughs> you talking about I ain't done yet, you crazy motherfucker. <laughs> Shit, I'm gonna have a village called Griffin when I get there. <laughs> I'm building this entertainment empire to leave it to the retarded child. And I got options. One of them gonna be the genius. And I'm gonna leave that nigga everything. I said, nigga, it's all yours. Take care of your brother and sister. Don't give them too much. You know they ain't about shit. <laughs> Cause you know when all our kids around, any parents in here know what I'm talking about, you're supposed to say, you know, I love y'all all the same. <laughs> Damn well you got your favorites. Cause in every family, nigga, there's that one demon seed. Mine's name is Elijah. This little motherfucker came out to destroy the world. Y'all whooped that nigga ass and it turned him on. Hmm? That nigga walk around like he's dirty. This motherfucker 12, nigga, walking up. Nigga. I'm on tour one time, I come home, nigga, my girl told me, you know, Elijah called me a bitch while you was gone. I said, huh? What'd he say? Call me a bitch. I said, bitch, where he at? <laughs> I said, Elijah! Little motherfucker came on stairs. You up, good? I said, you call your mama a bitch, nigga? Mm hmm? That's what you call her. I said, that's right. Cause that's my bitch. That's your mama. Now she was my bitch before she was your mama. Now say bitch again, motherfucker, and I'm bust you in your chest. That nigga did that face, nigga. I hit the nigga in the chest. <laughs> nigga, have you ever heard a chest kiss her back? <laughs> that motherfucker was searching for air, nigga. And I like when they make that sound, nigga. You can just talk to shit to them, nigga. And that's what I'm saying, nigga. Now that's my bitch. You ain't supposed to slip that word slang out your mouth. I don't understand what the fuck that means, nigga. I ask you a question. <laughs> Do that motherfucking duck sound again. I'ma hit you in the chest again. <laughs> he good in the motherfucker now. Straight A student. Very attentive. <laughs> you know what I mean? And fellas, we the only ones that can judge when we gonna have a bad seed. It ain't the women's fault. It's us. You got to judge it by how a nut feel. When you bust a nut, it ain't supposed to hurt. When you bust a nut, it come out smooth and you're like, oh, doctor, oh, lawyer, Indian chief. Nigga, you bust a nut, you're like, mm -hmm. pull out. Shoot that motherfucker against the wall. Shoot him in the head, let him land on your chest and dry out. Save yourself 18 years of hell visiting the motherfucker at the penitentiary or going to jail yourself for killing the little ignorant motherfucker. <laughs> Some of these motherfuckers are waste of a jackal. Thanks for the God should have put that nigga in toilet paper. <laughs> Should have been a crunchy towel. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about that's my son. I love him. Evil little motherfucker. You know, the rest of them, you know, I saved up for their college ones. That nigga, I'm saving bail money. <laughs> oh, he destined for jail. That nigga going. And I'm going to visit him one time. Fathers, we don't visit all the time. You know, that's why most of these motherfuckers in the penitentiary because y'all mamas just overload it. And they sitting up in there, here y'all come, first weekend. You mean anything, baby? You all right in there? I put some money on your books. Ain't nobody touching you in there, honey. See, fathers, we come and visit one time. That's that first time just to teach the bitch how to get there. <laughs> then we get there and look at the glass. Yeah, I told your ignorant ass this is how this shit gonna end up, huh? And I work two, three jobs. You ain't never going for a goddamn thing, boy. You wanna go out there and sell that dope? And I told you how this end, nigga. Open this bitch right here or in a casket. Now look at you. And if you think I'm coming every weekend to visit your ass, you got another goddamn thing coming, boy. I ain't coming up here on Saturday. That's my day off. <laughs> 
Now, when I get off, nigga, that's the day me and your mama fucks. So don't think she come neither, because you ain't good until my fucking time. Now, that was my bitch long before it was your mama, nigga. Let's get that straight. Now, I love you, boy. I said, don't you let nobody fuck you up in here. Your last name, Griffin. Now, represent, nigga. Somebody fuck you, you kill him. I'm putting all kind of money on your books. I love you, hit me, motherfucker. Get the car. Come on, come on, get the car. That's called tough love. See, women, y'all have love without condition. It's unconditional love, because you carry them little motherfuckers nine months. You squeeze their big head asses out your pussy until your pussy's destroyed. <laughs> Fathers have condition with our love, because we didn't care yet. We have conditions. Like, take the trash out. <laughs> and if it ain't taken out, I'm going to knock five from your motherfucking ass. Now, I'm going to hit you in the jaw, you're going to turn around and see what your own ass look like. <laughs> You ever been hit that horn? They're like, goddamn, they're my ass. 